The Netherlands has approximately 17,000 kilometers of dikes. The changing climate and increasing precipitation are more often putting the dikes in the Netherlands under pressure. This may result in unsafe circumstances during extreme weather. Therefore, the inspection and monitoring of dikes is of vital importance. Volker Vessels Telecom and Landers 3 Snake BV developed a system that checks the dikes from the inside and can even take action. The Dike Monitoring and Conditioning System, or DMC system, keeps Dutch dikes in perfect condition. The DMC system uses fiberglass sensors to collect information on the condition of the dike. The sensors measure the water pressure and water temperature in the dike, two indicators that provide information on the stability of the dike. The system is activated when indicators provide information that requires countermeasures. The system either discharges or infiltrates water. This increases the stability of the dike. The DMC system has been tested in practice during the Ike Dike experiments and the results were positive. A dike absorbs even more water during long periods of high water levels. The dike runs the risk of becoming saturated and weakens. In this situation, the dike loses some of its original strength. Long periods of high water levels can lead to the collapse of the dike. Piping can also lead to the breaching of dikes. Piping is when water flows under or through a dike due to a difference in water levels whereby the water also carries soil particles. This process starts very slowly, but the longer piping occurs, the faster and more extensive the flushing of soil particles from the dike becomes. The ground under the dike gradually erodes and the dike weakens. If piping does not stop, this process may lead to subsidence of the dike and ultimately its collapse. A large section of Dutch dikes consists of peat dikes or peat embankments. When peat dikes become too wet, the same processes occur as in non-peat dikes. The dike softens and partially loses its strength. When a peak dike dries out, the effect is different. The lack of water, drying out, causes the peat to oxidize, decreasing the stability of the dike. The water pressure dislocates these dry peat elements, causing dike shearing. Result, the dike ultimately collapses. HDDW technology is used to install the DMC system. HDDW, Horizontal Directional Drilled Wells, is a proven drilling technology which makes the underground installation of filter screens possible. These filters are sustainable, high-quality drainage pipes with a gravel pack, which prevents the filters from clogging. The drill hole is completely filled in to prevent subsidence of the dike. This method allows the horizontal extraction or infiltration of water in the dike. HDDW technology allows the installation of a filter over long distances without having to disturb the surface or the environment. The only visible disturbance of the system are the ends of the filter. Once the filter screens have been installed, the entire system is completely underground. The DMC system segments the dike into sections of approximately 150 meters. Flow meters, control valves and if required pumps are installed per segment. The water is extracted to decrease the internal water pressure of the dike or infiltrates to prevent the dike drying out. 
These measures can, if required, be performed automatically based on predefined settings. The measured values are forwarded using a data connection. This means the values measured in a dike can be read at the water board on any internet-enabled PC or mobile phone, allowing real-time control of the dike condition. The DMC system allows us to guarantee dike stability through real-time monitoring from within and to quickly and successfully intervene in the event of high pressure, piping or drying out of the dike. In short, the dike monitoring and conditioning system keeps dikes in perfect condition. Would you like to know more? Then please go to www.dmc-system.com